Jesus Christ, I look greasy. Uh, it doesn't matter. I'm about to be in the dark anyway. I just felt like singing a little. Early morning. She wakes up to a knock, knock, knock on the door. It's time for makeup. Perfect smile and it's who they're all waiting for They go isn't she lovely this Hollywood girl and They say she's so lucky She's a star, but she cry cry cries in her lonely heart thinking if there's nothing missing in my life, then why do these tears come at night? Lost in an image, in a dream, and there's no one there to wake her up. And the world keeps spinning, and she keeps on winning. But tell me, what happens when it stops? Right, that's where I'll stop. Old school Britney, y'all. Holler if you know it. Um, it is, we are only minutes into the seventh. Um, yeah, let's zoom in. Do, 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 do. About 12.29. And I am going to bed. Because I'm told that sleep is one of those things that human beings need and whatnot. And seeing as I haven't come up with a solution for me that doesn't involve sleep, I have to at least get a few hours in. Later. Hey guys, um, Gladys is a little upset with me, um, and mom wants me to go see about getting her a little present so that she'll be happy again. If y'all didn't know, Gladys is my car, and she's unhappy with me because I, I, I just gave her a full tune-up, just gave her a full tune-up. And apparently, now the ignition coil is what's fried, so... I gotta take what scraps I have and put it towards that. The only issue is, in order to get the ignition coil, I have to drive her to the store. And the last time I drove her... She cut off three times in a five to ten mile stretch. I'm afraid. I'm very afraid. So if I don't make it back home, you know why. Peace and love. Kids and queers, do not try this at home. I'm currently changing my own ignition coil. This is the new one. That there is the old one. As you can see, I disconnected it. I, I looked up some directions online, but um, it was for domestic cars. And so I was like, ooh, because the first glance I didn't recognize anything. But when I got the part, I noticed exactly what it was. And it said, disconnect the battery first so that I don't electrocute myself. And then unscrew the unplug that. Unscrew that. And now I'm dismounting this one from the engine. And hopefully the new one will slide right into place. I'll keep you updated as to how it goes. I'm being rugged today. Mwah. Ew. My hands are dirty. Okay. 
So 50% of the job is done. I got the old one out. Do do do. Do do do. Old one. And I'm about to put the new one in. Do do do. Do do do. Shiny. Hi. I'm about to earn some serious man points. Wish me luck. Everything's back in place. I believe I hooked those highlights up correctly. Let me reconnect my battery. And now, the real test. Let's see if she'll start. And the check engine light is off. Holy shit, I think I did it. I I'm gonna take her for a lap around the block and see how she runs, but I seriously think I just did it. <laughs> oh, okay. Thanks for going on this journey with me, as always. Um, I can't kiss my fingers because they're filthy, but mwah, peace and love. <laughs>